Welcome guys to a new tutorial series where we are going to build a quiz app that has an MVVM architecture and also Firebase authentication and Firestore. So let's just uh, dive right into the demonstration. And uh, so this is the list of the quiz, the data that the dummy data that I have stored in Firebase and uh, we can click on take quiz and this can show you the recent score that you had and how many questions and the level of the quiz and this is the timer the progress bar so if we do not answer then it shows us time up we can go next towards the next question and these are just the random questions if you were if your answer is correct you are seeing the feedback in here and if your answer is wrong then you are seeing the feedback here and the timer stops right away and if we go to answer this in the end we can submit the results in firebase and we can fetch it to display here and according to the scores this will show us the progress and if you click home that means user cannot take it again unless they start again from the list items from the recycler view that we are displaying and I will also show you a little bit of firebase that what is the back end of this app looks like so before so I'll just pause the video for now so I can go to the Google and open this project so guys back in my firebase console if we go into the cloud fire store if you see my old video I have worked with real-time database which is here but firestore is something new which gives more control to the user when it comes to storing data and it creates collection for each so yeah because in the real time database you create child and uh, sort the sort your data with that i'll not be going into that but i'm using the latest one which is cloud firestore and in this like see question quiz list uh, the quiz random id and that quiz has two collections one is for the questions and one is for the results so earlier the quiz that we had taken if we go in there so it should be reflected that uh, if we take a quiz now and i would just quickly and i would just miss one question so if what we have done here has to be updated here so after we submit result this will be shown in here you see this so this is some error in the old app that we can fix later don't worry about it but having said that what we are doing is that all the questions this is the collection for the results and the questions that you saw are here so these are the fields and we have created mvpm architecture to fetch this data so without a further ado i'll see you in the next tutorial where we will be working with the project setup see you guys and don't forget to subscribe